All right, what's up, guys? Welcome back to another episode of G Team Outdoors. Sitting on the point this morning, um, where we were yesterday. Hopefully, we could put up another big bag. I mean, yesterday was amazing, and I kind of—I didn't stop fishing, but I kind of just sat here and like made a few casts here and there, and caught two 19s. I think that didn't help me, so I stopped fishing. Started looking for new water, um, as I'm sure you saw in that video, but. Day two of the West Coast Championship, sitting in second place out of it by three quarters of an inch. So that's that's very doable here on this lake. There's some giants. Um, but yeah, we're gonna glide and jig and maybe throw the Senko around a little bit. Maybe a little top water in the morning because I did see them blowing up yesterday. Um, but yeah, let's see what we can do, guys. Wish me luck and let's get it done. All right, guys, we're less than a minute away from lines in. Just getting all my tackle situated. Praying for a good day on the water, a good safe day on the water. Hope my dad and my little brother stick them down where they are at. And it looks like the bass are still pushing bait up right here. That's what's happening. This point has a, a nice little underwater grass patch. And uh, I should have brought my glasses. Um, and these bass are just... Whenever they, the, they could get the bait to push out. Oh, they're blowing up right here. I think I wasn't gonna throw top water, but I think I am. I tie, brought it with me. There it is, six o'clock, lines in. I'm gonna start off with top water. I didn't catch anything on top yesterday, mostly because I didn't throw it, but we're gonna try it. There it is, first cast. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding, I'll do that. There you go, first cast out of the way. And uh, backlash first cast. There's probably a backlash in here. Oh my God. Eighteen two five. Let's go, baby. Stay down. Stay down, stay down, stay down. Let's go, baby.
18 and a half. Shit, it popped off. Seventeen and three quarters, that's a good one. Oh. My God, it's a giant, bro. Yeah, bro. Oh my god. That's one of the right ones. Guys, GoPro is freaking repairing a file, but just stuck a 22.5 working on a giant bag. Let's see how, what else we could get. Hopefully, this GoPro turns back on. <laughs> Stupid. Come on, baby. Seventeen.
That's definitely not gonna help. This is gonna help, bro. Oh my, come on Anthony. Dude, you cannot be doing that. I think that's a quarter inch call. Got a call at 17.75 now. That's a good call, 19.
We're almost to 200. We need to break an 1825. Come on, baby. 18 and a quarter. That's a hell of a call. Gotta have bay fuel, dude. I think it's it's really like a, a difference maker. Relax. That should be another 19. Let's go, baby. That's going to put us over 200 inches. Holy smokes. 200 inches on the dot. We got to call an 18 and a half. What a freaking day. It's gonna help. No, that's not gonna help. And it looks like it's long. Dude, these things are just fat though, bro. They're not long. <laughs> it looks like another 19, I think. I think, I don't know. Hey, relax. Good one, 19.
Fish yeah. No, that's on the way. Fat bro, but it's not gonna call. God. Nope. I could already tell. Um, had a had a really good two days. Uh, caught all my fish basically on a swim bait. Caught all my fish on a swim bait. <laughs> and uh, yeah, and uh, something else, but can't talk about it right now. Because there's a tournament tomorrow, and I don't want to mess some guys up. But uh, yeah, I had an amazing two days. Uh, my best tournament in inches. We'll see how we end up. Sir, we are on second place. 200 and, or 200.5 inches. $5,453. Anthony Garcia. Thank you. And he's standing right here. So we have the only angler that beat 100 inches every day. 202.5 inches. 8,070 taken home. Cayman Rasmussen, our first dual winner. This is your second time winning. All right, guys, hopefully you guys enjoyed that video. Uh, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Uh, had a blast at Clear Lake. Taking second place again. Back to back years in the West Coast Championship. But overall, had an amazing time. Uh, caught a ton of fish, caught some giant fish. 
and the ways that I like catching them on the jig and the glide bait can't beat it uh, so yeah we'll catch you guys on the next video probably gonna be a Lake Murray Pan American Championship video where we're representing Team USA so it should be a blast uh, but yeah hopefully you guys have an amazing week and we'll see you guys next time on GT Outdoors